Okay, boys, so if you've been paying attention, you'll see that this is that box from all of that stuff that you see from the video over here or over there or probably over here. All right, so let's get this unboxed. Once again, we rocking that Campion. You heard me? Merry Christmas to all. Let's dig in. Now, there are, there is supposed to be two boxes. I got one box today. I mean, yesterday on the 24th. Today is the 25th. The other one, he had to ship a little slower because it's got all of the bodies and stuff in it. So, I guess this right here would be the box that got the car, the remote control, and I guess the tires. So, we'll see. Let's go through this real quick. Okay, so here's the car, the lipo that came with it. It's Eternity. Let's get the sound checker out real quick. Okay, here we go. Right here. Let's check these cells. That's total percentage. This is cell one, cell two, cell three. Okay, so this battery is pretty good then. Still a pretty good pack. All right, so that's a good one. Good right there. This is the car itself. It came with a castle it has a aero rc fan castle sidewinder looks pretty good to me look pretty intact so that's the vehicle this is the battery so that's the whole setup that i will be running right out the box so let's take all the rest of this stuff out and do a little quick overlook of what we got here. Whoa, it just fell out through the bottom. All right. So let's look at this. All right, that's it. All right, and that's it. So we got four. Unbranded tires look like they off road of some type. Then these look like the drifting wheels right here. Four sets of black. And these right here look like more drifting tires. Gold. And the car also came with a set of rims and tires. So all together, four sets of tires. Let's bring the car into the picture real quick. Probably got to put that bumper on like that to get the full effect. We do have a wing. Somebody look like they butchered the hell out of this. I don't even know how that's supposed to go. We got some windows of some type. Once again, somebody butchered the hell out of that. So I don't know what this guy was trying to do, but I also got some Ford GT stickers with it. So hopefully the bodies will be here tomorrow so I can finish this video and do some speed runs and probably like the spring. We're not even gonna bust that out right now. It's kind of cold. 
I need to find me some roads for speed runs, but I'm going to put this car up here real quick. And we're going to take a look at this remote. Loving the bag. It's an old school remote. It is actually a XX3 Pro JR Racing. All right, let's take a look at it. It comes with the old school jump off. This thing, it's not, it hasn't even been open. So this is basically like brand new. Dude never even used it. What is this? This is a tough ass remote. No antenna? Okay. And, oh, two different color antennas. I don't know, man. Y'all let me know about this remote control. This remote control might just have to be on display. This thing is pretty serious right here. And to have this case, I might have to go get another phone insert and put another, a different remote control in here and put this one on display. Cause this thing is bad property, boy. I like that. So, yeah, I'm going to look this up online and see what this actually costs and see if I got a hit on that one, too. But basically, for the price that I paid for this, so I got the remote, the car fully done up with the battery, got three extra sets of tires, and I got three bodies coming on the way. Leave it in the comments and you let me know was this a deal, a steal, or what? I'm going to go with a steal. Because if you look at the price, the price for this um, as a roller is one, I'm going to say $140. It probably hit you with $10 on shipping or $20, depending on where you at. So we'll bump that all the way up to, um, we'll, we'll bump it up to 160 on the safe side. So all together, I think I paid 160 for this. It'll be in the video. So 160 for everything that you see here, plus three bodies. You know what I mean? So you let me know. I went to my hobby shop in Danbury and I picked this body up right here. I was gonna use it for my um for my for my forte. <laughs> This body right here is looking pretty beefy. Let me take y'all down and let y'all see what's going on. Let y'all see what's going on real quick. So that is beefy. Then we got the tires right here. You know what I'm saying? I know I had the camera up mad high, but it is what it is. And then we got this right here. I'm going to put that in full depth for y'all real quick. This is just mock-up right now. I'm just throwing it up here. I'm going to have to go get um, another one of these bodies. I like this right here. But, yeah, I'm going to bring you all in depth and let you all see what's going on with that JR remote control right there. this and put this on the charger. Take it from there. Everything look pretty good though, y'all. That was a tight squeeze. Yeah, 
Yeah, that was a super tight squeeze he had going on with this. Three things to go. All right, y'all. Stay tuned for when we get the bodies in the mail. I can show y'all what to do. And yes, this is that stand. I actually got it to rotate now. So, I'll at your boy. RC Hot Boy, and I'm out. Some nice shiners, too. They don't shine brighter than that, but they shine. Deep. That's good.